Chapter 77, and welcome back to Pokemon Red. In the last episode, we got Eevee! And I guess we're going to use this Eevee eventually, but for right now, just keep it in the party. And we got here to Celadon City. <clears throat> and in this episode... We are going to, I guess, we're either going to go to the Rocket Hideout or to Celadon Gym, depending on what's available to us. I think we're going to try to go through the Rocket Hideout first. Yep, we're going to go to the Rocket Hideout first. Yay! If you guys are excited for this episode, make sure to leave a like, and let's just jump right into it with a battle. Oh man, that's exciting. Oh man, last time I was talking about Pokemon Unite, um, and I think, it, you know, I think it's pretty cool. Um, a lot of people ask me about the, um, the Pokemon Cafe game, or whatever it is. I don't really think that's a good... I, I mean, uh, sure, I get it for some people, but I don't particularly like it. I'm not into, like, addiction games, which is why I hate Fortnite to the, to the end to the earth. You know? Stuff like Fortnite and Call of Duty, like, I hate, I hate, I hate. Because they're addiction games, and it's just super annoying. But, whatever. Um, I mean, don't get me wrong, I can see why people love those games. I, I totally get it, but for me, I just don't like them. You know? But, anyway... Um, another thing I, a lot of people, a lot of people have been asking me what I think about the DP remix. Now that they look a little nicer. Um, I, I think they've got potential. I do. I really do. Um, I think they'll actually be pretty good. Will they be as good as the original Diamond and Pearl? Nah. Nah. Not even by a long shot. But, I think they have the potential to be good. So, we'll see what happens. Oh, Firo learned Drill Pack in the last episode. Or not in the last episode, but the episode before the last episode. When I trained off screen. So. That's some good news. Let's see what else we got in here. Just kind of hoping for more battles. Hey! Right when I say I was hoping into more, ba I was hoping for more battles. The game gives me another battle. Ask and it shall deliver. That is awesome, man. I tell you what, though, I was um, I was uh, I was thinking a lot about uh. Ruby, Sapphire, and Emerald. And then I started thinking about Omega Ruby, Alpha, Sapphire, and how freaking awesome those games are. Like, like the DP remakes, you know, I mean, they're going to be alright. Think about how cool Omega Ruby and Alpha, Sapphire were. They added new stuff on top of, like, everything else. Like, I would say Omega Ruby, Alpha, Sapphire are probably the best remakes. The best. I know IGN said the whole too much water, but it, it, that's what they said about Ruby and Sapphire and Emerald. Like, who cares? It's gonna have sea routes in them. Black and white sea routes were way worse. You know? Like, when I was playing Black 2, the sea routes were probably one of the worst parts. But, I mean, I guess I get that. But, I mean, come on, man. Like, you can't hate 
Ruby, Sapphire, and Emerald. You just can't. Especially not Omega, Ruby, Alpha, Sapphire, either. Considering the fact that the Mega Evolutions are so worth it. On top of catching every Legendary in the game, except for maybe like three or four Mythicals. Like, come on, man! I'm going to go into the game. But, I mean, that, those games were awesome. I love those games. It's probably because I love X and Y so much. But, I mean, X and Y was good. And they were great. That was a fantastic generation. A lot of people hated on that gen on Gen 6 because everybody thinks it was terrible, but it wasn't. Uh, I'll go to Hero. But, like, I love Gen 6. Probably the best gen- it was, it was the best gen at the time. I would say. I would say that. Wish they would have done more with it because it would have been epic, but nope. They sure as heck didn't. Um, but yeah, man. But, uh, you know, and the legendaries were so good. There weren't enough legendaries, but at least there were legendaries. You could catch every non mythical legendary Pokemon in both X and Y and Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire. Because guess what the only three legendary Pokemon, or four legendary Pokemon, that weren't in Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire? Articuno, Zapdos, Moltres, and Mewtwo! And that's it! Where is this taking me? Okay. Um, but yeah! Like, you could capture every non-legendary. Think about how crazy that is. Hey, we got a Moonstone, by the way. TM07, let's see what that is. Horn Drill. Noise. Well, I'm not, probably not gonna use that. I was saying, like, think about how crazy that is. I mean, even in X, even in Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire, they had events where you could get at least a couple mythical Pokemon. Like, you could catch, um, what else did they have? They had, um. I know Keldeo, Meloetta, um... Okay, that was the wrong way. Okay. 
Uh, okay. Okay, so this will lead us up here to this item. Yeah, bingo, right there, boom. We got a nugget! But yeah, I, I guess what I was trying to get at with the whole Gen 6 thing was that you could literally catch every legendary in the game. At least for the most part. There was even a couple mythical Pokemon in there too. You could catch, you could catch, um, uh, Deoxys. I'm not going to tell you how, but I'm going to tell you that you can. Did I just solve this puzzle? Pretty sure I did. So let's go up here. Let me go down here. Let me do that. Like, think about how crazy that is. Yep, another rocket battle! Why did you come here? For because it is my destiny. Well, I guess this will be the, the last battle of this episode, and then we'll have to uh We'll have to continue on next time on Game Cat Ooh, next time on Game Cat here's this situation. But um But yeah, I guess I'll go more into Gen 6 in the next episode. But yeah, that's just that's just me. You know. Take a tech. Oh, we are almost out of time. Alright, well, that is enough for this episode. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!